Let's make South Indian lunch. For rasam and pappu inside a pressure cooker, place a bowl with washed dua dal water, little salt, oil, turmeric, chopped raw mango, methi leaves, and pressure cook for six whistles. Mash the dua dal well and keep it aside. For raw mango methi leaves pappu place a pan on flame and add oil green chilies boiled raw mango and methi leaves and fry for few seconds you can also add tamarind extract but i have skipped since the raw mango is already a little tangy in taste add jaggery and sambar powder and fry for about a minute then add boiled and mashed dua dal and mix everything well then add water salt as per taste and mix everything well and cook it on low medium flame for about 10 minutes and it is ready To prepare the rasam, add in the remaining cooked dua dal into the water and mix it well. Then to that add tamarind extract. Also add chopped tomatoes, water and mix everything well and place it on flame. Then add curry leaves, jaggery, salt as per taste, rasam powder and mix everything well and boil the rasam on low medium flame for about 7 to 10 minutes. Rasam is ready. For tempering the rasam and pappu, place a small pan on flame and add oil, mustard seeds, and once they crackle, add in the asafoetida and mix everything well. And add this tempering to the pappu and rasam. For the sabudana paisam, place a pan on flame and add soaked sabudana, water, milk, sugar, and mix it well and boil it on low medium flame for about 10 to 15 minutes. Once the sabudana paisam thickens to almost perfect consistency, add in the cardamom powder, cashew nuts and raisins fried in the ghee, and add it to the paisam and mix everything well. My grandmother made her special cucumber pickle. For that, into a bowl, add chopped cucumber, salt as per taste, turmeric powder, red chilli powder, coriander powder, and mix everything well. For the tempering, place a small pan on flame and add oil, mustard seeds, and once they crackle, add in the asafoetida, dry red chilies, and add this tempering to the pickle and mix well. It is serving time now. Enjoy, guys! Happy cooking!